what's the deal capricorn as always right you are one of the most viewed uh, zodiac signs for uh, my august monthly reading so you will be getting a pop-up peak reading for the month of september we're gonna be tuning into your life seeing what's going on seeing what you need to be prepared for seeing what's happening with you going into the month of september so, um, any placement of Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Mercury, Rising, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, North Node, and South Node placements, anybody who would like to be nosy, I am back open. I am back open uh, for personal readings. Uh, contact and booking information is in the description box down below. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. So, uh, what we're going to do is pull one card to see what your overall energy is going to be going into the month of September and during the month of September. And then we're going to do a spread for you guys, okay? Throw that over there. So, here, guys. Um, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? We are officially leaving the summer season. Okay, so here, guys. What's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? I can't wait. I do not fuck with summer. I, I fuck with early parts of spring, okay? Or fall. It's where I thrive, baby. Spirit guys. Uh, what's the overall? Oh, 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 booty up, so I'm not gonna look at it. Spirit guys, what's the overall energy of the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? Two of Wands. So I'm getting this energy of Capricorn. You need to stay focused going into the month of September and during the month of September. Um, two of Wands is your overall energy with the Nine of Wands showing up on the bottom of the deck. Um, two of Wands for me is upcoming things that you could need to take care of you want to do you want to initiate right um nine of wands for me can be about you know being um guarded okay but also um what's the word i'm looking for uh like uh, being able to stand on something like you know i meant what i said i said what i meant um i committed to this so i'm going to do it i don't know what's the word for that Okay, it's like there's a there's a level of commitment that I feel like comes with the nine of wands. Okay, and nine minus two equals seven of wands. So I feel like some of y'all, like I said, need to um stay focused going into the month of September and um execute like a form of a discipline with yourself. That's the seven of wands. Whenever it comes to certain things that you're trying to do or are doing going into the month of September and during the month of September. Three guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac? One is to the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023. That's how we start in the month off, okay? Five of Pentacles, money woes, girl. What's going on with the funds? Talk to me, girls. What's going on with the coinage? Okay, Ace of Wands, Hermit, Hierophant. Okay. If you feel very much out of place, don't know which way you're going, um, it's because you're in the wrong lane. Okay, two of wands to me kind of uh, reminds me of kind of like uh, you can go this way or you can go this way. Okay, same thing with the two of swords, right? So, whenever it comes to the five of pentacles in this card, she kind of looks lost. Like, I don't know if I should go left. I don't know if I should go right. And then if you can tell there's two like little gnomes right there trying to tell her to go this way. Okay, that way, right? Um... Ace of Wands, Hermit, Hierophant, the Ten of Swords, or the Magician. Some of y'all, I do feel like the more in tune you become spiritually, the more um, evolving you start to grow. grow. Editing, thank you. The more um, growing you start to do, right? Um, I feel like with the Magician, Ten of Swords, and the Ace of Wands, I'm hearing some of y'all want to do the swap out. It's like you want to start new things, start new chapters, start new beginnings, but that's going to require you to end certain things, okay? Um, yeah, some of y'all, like I said, might want to pursue something new for yourself ace of wands can uh, be in regards to anything right with the five of pentacles maybe you feel like financially you can't get it done maybe you don't know which way to go right which direction you're heading in so here guys what's going on with the capricorn zodiac going into the month of was that my ankle going into the month of september during the month of september in the year 2023 that didn't sound well 
King of Pentacles. Oh, hey, man, with the King of Swords. Can y'all explain this to me, sir? Um, I also feel like some of y'all could be kind of like in this deciding stage over who you do and don't want around you. Um, there's a lot of players here. We got the King of Swords, Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords, and we got the King of Pentacles showing up, okay? Um, some of you guys have already kind of made these. Girl, I just heard cutbacks. Is this having to do with work or are you having, you know, girl, going into the month of September rationing, all right? Um, but I am seeing some of you guys have been going through this I'm hearing continuous season of having, to, of having to cut people off, disassociate from people, remove certain people from your life, whether it be uh, intimate relationships, uh, friendships, uh, familial. Come on, girl. Y'all know my verbiage ain't like that. Okay, familial meaning like family. I don't know why familial came to mind, girl. I, I mean, come on. I mean, I appreciate it, but you know. <laughs> But any sort of relationship, okay? Some of y'all, if you've already know that you've been going through this phase of just cutting people off left and right, I'm seeing it happen with an Aquarius, a Gemini, a Libra, an Aries. I just heard the Virgo. So you guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? Well, gosh, godly Capricorn, not the best, the best energy to start off with. Star with the Six of Cups. Damn, babes, come on. We got to put you on the chair, girl. We got to put you on the chair, Capricorn. Some of y'all feel, either you feel like you have, or girl, I'm here to tell you, okay? Breaking news, my niggas. Some of y'all feel like you lost like a certain uh spark within yourself. Five of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, and the Star card, you know what's there. Um, You know that you want certain things for yourself with the Five of Pentacles. It's like you could have a lack of, a lack of motivation. <laughs> Um, a lack of motivation, just feeling like financially your shit ain't together, um, not really knowing what direction you're heading in during this time. It's like, God, just don't, it's giving a little bit of depression, mild depression. So, uh, yeah, just a little bit, girl. We don't want to joke about the type of thing, though. Damn. Yeah, some of y'all uh, could feel like your job is real boring, okay? Uh, your job is real boring. The career that you could be trying to pursue right now might not be. Eh. It's like financially you might uh, want to pursue this because it's something that, you know, pays your bills or is going to pay your bills, whether you are in this right now or you are pursuing this, right? With the four swords, it's like, girl, where's the excitement? Where's the excitement, girl? It's giving Mr. Anderson. We do have some Mr. Andersons in here, Capricorn girl. You need to become Neo. We need you, okay? Two of Pentacles, Six of Cups, Justice, Ten of Pentacles, and the Four of Swords. Well, I'm going to be honest with you. Whenever the star card comes out in your reading, I am a fan of that, okay? Because that points to me like, you know... It's almost like you have the guiding light around you. You know what the guiding light is. It's like you um, you have at least an idea of uh, what you want for yourself, right? But, you know, uh, funds, direction, motivation, effort, ambition. It could be a little skewed right now, babes, okay? Um, I feel like some of y'all got to ask yourself, two of pentacles, six of cups, justice, ten of pentacles, and the four of swords. Am I holding on to outdated beliefs, principles, ways of doing things, visions, perspectives that's really keeping me from entering this new chapter that I want to be in? Mind you, girl, we're in heavy retrograde season, okay? Mercury is currently retrograde, girl, so sit your ass down, okay, for the, for the time being. We... 
It's just not the time, okay? It's not the time to be starting new things, right? But it is the time for you to be in preparation mode for what you want to start getting into, right? Whenever Mercury, um, well, shit, whenever most of these planets start going direct, girl. It's been, it's been a tough year, okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, Divine Fem, men, you out here too. Okay, I'm not excluding anybody, right? But we got Empress, King of Pentacles, Hangman, Nine of Swords, and the Queen of Pentacles. Some of you guys, you don't like to fail. Some of y'all could feel like you're failing because you, you're not where you want to be at during this time. Uh, it could be living wise, it could be financial wise, it could be career wise. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? Four of Swords. Yeah, babes. Very much Mr. Anderson, okay? It's like a lot of y'all could be like deactivated during this time. It's almost giving like hibernation mode. I, I want to say hermit, but hermit mode is like not, I don't want to say intentional it is. It's like um, getting yourself together, you know, kind of like feeling like you're needing to piece together certain things within yourself or things that's going on around you, right? Five of Pentacles and the Four of Swords is very much, you know, doom and gloom, girl. It's getting a little emo in here, all right? Oh, no, no, ma'am, this is what we don't need. Six of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, and the Seven of Swords. So much so that some of y'all might be kind of like backsliding in regards to certain things. It's like, you know, you sleeping in. Uh, your house look a mess. You're not taking care of your responsibilities. You're waking up. It's like, you don't give a fuck. That's what you're giving me right now, Capricorn. I don't appreciate that. I don't like it for you. I know you're better than that. Okay? So, you know, get your ass up off that couch. <laughs> do the dishes. Do whatever you need to, babes. Okay? But I do feel like some of y'all need, like, a little bit of, you know, a boost, a motivator or something. So, here, guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? Page of Cups is giving man in the mirror energy. Okay? Who you want to be? We got the page of cups lining up with the star card. Some of y'all got to start, start asking yourself that. Who do you want to be? Okay. Do you want to consistently be in a position of where you, you know, needing, wanting, struggling, wishing, hoping? Okay. Or do you want to be living up to your standard? Now, you need to be careful, Capricorn, because you tend to have unrealistic standards for yourself. Okay. But if you know there's a certain level in life that you want to start achieving achieve then you know you might need to look at your performance sometimes it ain't you working harder sometimes it's you working smarter okay you know what i'm about to tell you you know what i'm about to say because i'm always telling you i'm always telling you okay you gotta get out your comfort zone you gotta get out your comfort zone. You can't. You you. First of all, some of y'all gotta start stop thinking that it's only left or right. You only got the two of wands. No, that's all that you're thinking. No, that's all that you're willing to think that it is. Okay, you got the star card showing up in your reading. The the the, the possibilities are limitless, girl. You can go up, down, diagonal, vertical, horizontal, girl. It's not just left or right. Okay. Tower, Ace of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, Six of Wands, and the Hierophant. Some of y'all gotta be willing confidant enough okay fearless enough to break away from some normal mundane comfortable routine that you're used to used to tower card it's not working out for you anymore okay i forgot what like i was watching but you know when you scroll and you just happen to hear certain messages <laughs> uh i was scrolling on tiktok okay horrible i was scrolling on tiktok and i just kept scrolling but I, I heard i heard what they were saying um before i scrolled to the next thing so where it was like um god won't allow you to be comfortable in any sort of circumstance that isn't for you so if some of y'all feel like you know girl this can't be life is this all that there is i want more for myself then yes yeah, you you's right okay you're supposed to be doing more feeling more experiencing more for yourself right
It can't be that. It could be. <laughs> it could be. Ah, uh, y'all wanna hear about that girl? Y'all feel like y'all always hearing about this shit. You know, if you don't care, you can keep, you can just fast forward it just a little bit. Just a look at it. Um. Of course, there could be somebody turning back on you, watching you during this time. Who you know? Wants to come back around you, but they don't know what to say, so they just stay in the back. I don't want to take too much time touching on that. <laughs> Seriously, guys. Excuse me, by the way. What's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? Nine of Pentacles. I-N-D-E-P-E-N-D-E-N-T. That's what I mean. Four of Swords, Page of Cups, and Nine of Pentacles. Now, some of y'all, if you need to take some time out for some R and R rest and rejuvenate, girl, please. Okay. Some of y'all do need to rest. You can't figure out which way is left and which way is right because you're tired as hell. You only run on three hours of sleep. Okay. You're not getting enough rests, right? You're not taking enough 16, 16 confirmations. Thank you. You're not taking enough time out to star card. I'm hearing like re uh what's the word? restore yourself okay this for me is like if you got like the five day work week you know working a nine to five um i hate this for you but you know the weekend is time for you know get your shit back back right okay maybe you need to take a take a day off use the pto that you got okay i'm just seeing that some of y'all need to make sure that you're taking enough time out to um restore yourself you know what i mean and whenever you have this time don't just, you know, be a slug. You know, I understand that you're tired. I understand that maybe you just don't feel like it. You're not motivated, okay? That's why discipline is important. But uh, um, it's, it's kind of like setting yourself up for success, you know? So why should this is in the sink? That way you got to, you know, worry about waking up the old crusty dishes in the morning. Um, make sure you're staying on top of your chores. Make sure you're saving money just in case you run into a situation where some unexpected expense, you know, hits you out the blue. Okay. Set yourself up for success, right? Don't shirk off on certain responsibilities. And then when some bad shit happen, you know, you kind of like, girl, I'm just lost in the sauce right now. You don't want to be like that, right? You don't want to be like that. Okay, fine. <laughs> we'll talk about it. Some of y'all doing so much better without somebody. Um, I feel like you're much better off without somebody. Heavy on the air, heavy on the water. Aquarius, Libra, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. It's like when I feel like you were attached to this person, friendship, lovership, family ship. It's like you kind of lost yourself a little bit, maybe taking on this person's problems, this person's issues, just being around this person. They could have been not the best energetic person to be around, okay? Four pinnacles, will of fortune. I feel like moving forward, you might limit your accessibility, right? That this person has to you, or you just decided to completely keep yourself from this individual. Yes, good on, good eye, might. Spirit so guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of uh, September in the year 2023? Eight of Cups with the Hierophant, Five of Pinnacles, Four of Swords, and the Eight of Cups. Some of y'all got a little bit of a job. Some of y'all have got to leave a job. This cubicle, this desk. I don't know, girl, this call center. Okay, some of y'all have a real born job. I understand it pays the bills, okay? But at what point... I'm going through this too, by the way, you know, so I don't want to, you know, make it seem like, girl, I'm on the soapbox. I'm not any, okay, girl, I'm in the crowd, okay? Um, at some point, you got to start asking yourself, when is my lane going to change from just doing what I need to to pay the bills to actually pursuing my passions or funding my passions, my actual dreams, you know? Eight of Cups, Page of Cups, and Star Card, but that's for another video and another time. Okay, we got to get you in a separate chair for that. It's like you having to really ask yourself, am I willing to walk away from things that might be comfortable but keeping me away from my assignment, keeping keeping me away from my, um, my actual path, you know?
Some of y'all could be daydreamers. You know, you're always kind of like visualizing or fantasizing about the life that you want, the uh, space that you want to be in, the things that you want. All right, but <laughs> and I heard it's like your real life keeping you away from that or just certain things that you have attached to your real life are keeping you away from that, okay? Spirit guys, what's going on with the Capricorns over here? Going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023. Knight of Cups with the Emperor. Oh, Lord. Bro, I'm, I'm trying to talk about you and your problems. <laughs> And what you got going on? I see some other shit popping up, okay? Something happened to do with some love situation, okay? Listen to this, right? Check this out. I'm seeing there's someone here that walked away from you due to insecurities, girl, however it goes, right? That still be thinking about you. I can understand that. I'm not saying I'd ever do it. Never, never been in that sort of situation. You know, I'm too pimping for that. But I see that someone here was, you know, I don't know why, how, or when, but I don't really feel like, you know, you bullied them or anything. You being you, of course, made someone feel inferior or insecure being around you. Um, they were kind of always second guessing themselves, doubting themselves, or, um, like I said, projecting insecurity, being around you. So with the Eight of Cups, they could have, you know, lean back on you. Did the lean back on you, girl, okay? They still there. Maybe not physically or maybe they don't come around a lot. Maybe y'all don't speak a lot. Maybe y'all don't speak at all, okay? But they're still there energetically. Last card. Spirit guys, how's, this, uh, how's the Capricorn Zodiac? What's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of September and during the month of September in the year 2023? Four of Cups. So we're going to end the reading talking about your secret admirer, apparently, okay? It said enough about Capricorn, girl. Let's talk about me. That's what. That's the feeling that I get. Is that a little odd? Is that a little strange? Okay. I get the feeling, right? High Priestess in the Moon card has shown up. So, girl, so I really wouldn't be surprised. I get the feeling, right, that there's someone here outside your energy that I feel like you really are not making, like, a priority, like, none whatsoever, who is kind of like, forget your problems, Capricorn, for a minute. Let's discuss you and I. Let's discuss what's going on between you and I. Excuse me? They what? Some of y'all, this could be a past friend, a past lover, someone that you used to have some sort of connection with. It's like, fuck your problems, Capricorn. What about us? What about what's going on between me and you? I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like it, okay? It's like someone here is very dismissive of what you might be going through and everything. And they just kind of just want to like bombard you with their shit, okay? Like I said, this could be someone here that turned their back on you. They kind of separated themselves from you, right? Heavy on the water, heavy on the air. Aquarius, Libra, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You want to know why, though? Nine of Pentacles. You got it. You good. It's like someone here might think that you're always on You're always on a high. You're always on an up. So they feel like, you know, you got to spare. You got the energy to spare. You got the ear to spare, the shoulder to cry on. Everything's fine with you. I don't like niggas like that. I don't. Okay, bitches, niggas. I don't. I don't care. Okay. Oh, girl. Yeah, honey. This person trash for you anyway. <laughs> Devil. All right. Um. Now, Capricorn. Either you are the toxic individual to someone. They don't want to hear your whine. Okay. They don't want to hear your bullshit no more. Um. So they separate themselves from you. Or Capricorn. This is someone outside of you. Heavy on the water. Heavy on the air. There's a little bit. Just a little bit of fire. You got Sagittarius and Aries showing up the strongest. Okay. It like it, it gives me the feeling of someone here likes to bounce from person to person, kind of just like unloading or kind of using people to distract them from what's going on in their own personal life, right? But they don't give a fuck about what that person might be going through, the baggage that they leave that individual with. You know what I mean? 
Capricorn, this was your September pop-up peak reading. Any placement of Capricorn, like the video, leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. My pricing and content information is in the description box down below. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. Bye. I'll talk to you later. <laughs>